Okay, I'm uploading another video. This is a uh, Herbie Hancock rocking it. Now, um, remember the old school Herbie Hancock? I just downloaded this off the internet and it was free. So, um, if you want to know the chords to uh, any particular song, once again, there's thousands and millions and millions of MIDI files. Some are for free. Some you got to pay maybe uh, you know a dollar or two dollars, but it may be worth it. So, this is a tutorial on a multi channel MIDI file and so we just loaded uh, Herbie Hancock rocking it in there and I want to show you some aspects of a multi MIDI file okay so here we go Herbie Hancock rocking it okay so we got this MIDI file right now the thing is this is called the piano channel the piano channel is the channel that shows up on the keyboard, okay? So you hear there's a whole bunch of different sounds, right? There's a whole bunch of different channels. Let's take a look at the, see? Now this right here is the bass. You see right here, the piano channel is what shows up on the keyboard. So this is the pick bass. So let's look at uh, the other channels. Let's look and see what the guitar is doing. That's the guitar. Now let's hear what that lead guy is doing. Maybe he's on the the synth brass. There we go. Now let's pick another instrument and see what the I guess uh, uh, the synth drum nothing on there yet now that sounds like a pad synth brass we gotta follow it there we go so let me stop this for a moment so basically this piano channel is the channel that you pick to show on the actual keys so for example if you got a like this rock in it and you hear you hear synth brass and you hear bass and you say I want to know what the bass is doing you change it to the bass and the sound right here that's assigned to it through the MIDI file is going to show what if you want to change that picked bass into a fingered bass let's try that it's starting from the beginning okay Go a little further. Okay, that's the bass. We can change that into a synth bass. We can change that synth bass too. Slap bass. See how I changed it? So, now here's some keys a little bit playing. Let me see uh, if we can choose some different instruments. That's the clav. See how I chose the clav? Now another thing you can do, let's pause it here. You can, uh-oh, uh, the sustain pedal's on, so we hit our, our, um, we hit our, uh, our panic button. So we go here to our channel, and these are all the channels. Channel one is slap bass, and if you want to mute it, you can mute it. You want to solo, you can solo it, you can change the volume of all of the channels on the mixer view, okay? So that's how you handle multi-level or multi-channel MIDI files and MIDI keys.